Life in Plastic has never been more fantastic than in Greta Gerwig's highly anticipated live-action, Barbie, movie. The first of its kind after more than 40 nostalgia-evoking animated films starring the iconic doll, Barbie, takes viewers on a fish-out-of-water adventure unlike any before as Barbie, Margot Robbie, and Ken, Ryan Gosling, experience the real world for the first time. With Gerwig helming the project alongside her partner and co-writer Noah Baumbach, as well as the multi-talented Robbie under her production company Lucky Chap Entertainment, audiences expect nothing less than a heartwarming, introspective, feminist-driven exploration of gender relations and the human condition. No pressure. The real pressure comes from living up to Mattel's more than 60-year legacy as the fashion doll's creator and manufacturer. Nevertheless, Gerwig and her team have had no trouble building hype for the movie so far. Between the film's inventive marketing strategy and eye-catching trailer, Barbie has quickly become the movie of the summer, if not the year. If you're looking to immerse yourself even further in the colorfully saturated world of Barbie, you've come to the right place. Let's unbox some Barbie-licious facts you may not know about the Barbie movie. It's taken 14 years of studio changes, rewrites, and recastings to get Barbie to the big screen, beginning all the way back in 2009 when Mattel first teamed up with Universal Pictures and producer Lawrence Mark. The project never got very far because, in 2014, Sony acquired the rights and hired Jenny Bix to pen the screenplay. Production was expected to begin by the end of the year, but by 2015, multiple rewrites were still being made by the likes of Diablo Cody, Lindsay Beer, Bert V. Royal, and Hilary Winston. Cody reflects on why she was never able to nail down a solid draft. When I was first hired for this, I don't think the culture had not embraced the femme or the bimbo as valid feminist archetypes yet, she told GQ. I didn't really have the freedom then to write something that was faithful to the iconography, they wanted a girl boss feminist twist on Barbie, and I couldn't figure it out because that's not what Barbie is. Actors Amy Schumer and Anne Hathaway were tied to the project at separate points. But by the time Sony's rights to the project expired in 2018, the project experienced another creative overhaul when moving to Warner Bros. Pictures. 